Avast ye be landed ashore of ascending tide. It'll be the fight to the death then. Prepare ye selves to loot and plunder your way to victory. Take pods, gents. Hello everybody, this is Dabby and welcome to a Minecraft Let's Play video. Today I am doing a round of Hunger Games on a map uh, which is called Ascending Tides. And this is a map uh, that was built by Builders Unit. Uh, the main builder is a uh, Chunky Shark, I believe. Yeah, Chunky Shark is the uh, the main creator. And uh, these are some of the, the other helpers. And I am playing with, well I'm playing against, uh, Ashdub, Spinball, Super Chat, Tank Matt, Jake on the Xbox, uh, Miss Minecraft, Xbox Live Arcade, aka Chloe, aka Big Big. Epic C and uh, also uh, Arbold as well, who is uh, the uh, the the uh, the creator and the the leader of Builders Unit. So I don't know how much help he did with the map. I don't know whether he's going to have uh, any advantages over knowing what's in the good chests, uh, but I'm hoping not. So <laughs> uh, yeah, I guess we're going to have to to wait and see. And I believe this is the the host pod here. So uh, yeah, once I'm ready, I'm just going to go and uh, hop down. Uh, so I'm just going to have, have a look to see if everyone else is ready. I think everyone is just getting them themselves prepared. I think there's. Uh, a few other people recording. I'm not entirely sure who is recording, but uh, in the description uh, there's going to be a link to uh, the download of the map, uh, the uh, link to the Builders channel, uh, as well as uh, all of the, the other players that I'm playing against. And the map looks awesome, by the way. I've not had a proper look around. I'm kind of experiencing it for the first time, but I had a, a very quick fly over and it looked amazing. And don't forget to subscribe to Builders Unit. You know, look at that. That masses advertising. A, a huge sign right in front of your face. <laughs> anyway, are, are we all ready? I think uh, one more person uh, is just about to, to go and uh, hop into their pods and then we can then we can get going it's a pretty big map so I'm going to be uh, leaving gamer tags on just so uh, there's not going to be too many boring moments of uh, people wandering around and uh, trying to find each other. And uh, so what I'm going to do, while uh, we get Jake back in the game and Arbold gets into his pod, I'm going to very quickly uh, cut ahead into the, uh, the video uh, until we're all set and ready to go. Okay, Jake's back in the game. Arbold has joined his pod, so let's begin in three, two, one, go, 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 go! And uh, I'm not actually sure whether we got a grace period, so... Um, oh god, I want to be quicker than this. God, look how slow I am, right? Go get all this stuff. Uh, look in this chest up here. Oh, there's so much rubbish! <laughs> there's so much rubbish that I don't need in these chests. And what's that? Oh, that's flint. Uh, might as well grab that anyway. Anything around here? Anything in any of these chests? Feathers and bowls and... Uh, nope, uh, a load of rubbish here. And there's a few people lagged out, but... Uh, hopefully someone who's uh, not recording is going to be uh, going and inviting all of them back in. And what is, what is with all this rubbish random stuff and all of these chests? I guess it kind of makes it more realistic. This is the kind of stuff that you would sort of get lying around in chests. But it's just not uh, particularly helpful during the, the middle of a, a round of Hunger Games. I've managed to get an axe though. And all a stone sword. A stone sword is not bad at all. Certainly for uh, right at the beginning of the game. So let's make sure I've got my, my stone sword at hand. Uh, I've got a splash potion of swiftness as well. And if I quick check. Here we go. I've got some chainmail armor. I've uh, got a bunch more arrows. I can hear someone having a little splash around downstairs somewhere. So let's go put my, my chainmail armor on. So I got uh, armor. I got a few uh, pretty nice potions. So uh, not a bad start off the beginning as well. And I got a load of feathers as well, just in the case uh, I want to make a, a chicken costume. And there's a pickaxe there. A whole load of bottles of enchanting. Uh, if I go get a bunch of them, I can try and maybe uh, enchant something. And uh, let's go for a wander then, shall we? Everyone seems to be all very compact in the, in the same area. I kind of want to uh, wander off and explore at my own pace. And oh, look. Ooh, that was a good place to go to. And oh, look, a bow as well. This was a, a really good place to go to, actually. And there's a furnace. Nothing in the furnace. All right, let's crouch here for a bit. And let's go get my stuff organized then, shall we? I've got my uh, my iron chest plate, which is an upgrade there. It'd be good to get some other armor, but an iron chest plate isn't bad. And I've got a, a bow and arrow as well now, so I can uh, try and take some, some people out at range. I don't want to go after anyone yet, though, because I always feel mean going straight for uh, after people at the beginning. And I think we... Uh, might still be in some sort of a grace period. I know there's people wandering all over the place over there. I kind of want to get away from everyone. I feel like I'm in the, the middle of a, a really busy town and I'm, I'm all panicking because there's a big crowd of people and I want to get away from it. The map looks so nice, doesn't it? Uh, it's been built in the... um. I thought, what's the, the texture pack called? It's called like the, is it like, ah, oh, the kingdom texture? I can't remember what the texture pack's called. I know there's a sign at the uh, the start telling me to, to make sure I've put it on, but uh, it's the one that I probably play in least. Uh, so it's actually uh, kind of nice to, to play in this one. And look at this castle over here. I've never even seen this before. There's got to be some, some good loot in here. Let's see if anyone's been here yet. Uh, I don't think they have because there's a load of arrows here. I'm going to take the, the spare bow as well just so no one else can steal it. No one's going to come up behind me. Are oh, they? Get back. <laughs> look at the, the top. Targets and all the weapons and stuff as well and the the painting is a, a really nice touch. 
Uh, there seems to be like some sort of pig pen over there. Uh, anything good in this chest? Uh, a stone sword. I don't really need that because I got the iron one. Uh, once again, I'm just going to steal it though just to uh, make sure no one else can get it. And uh, let's just make sure there's no one's coming up behind me. Oh look, there's like a there's like a dungeon under the, the castle down here. Let's go and explore the dungeons. Oh, there's like a, there's all like prisons down here. And whoa, that actually scared me. I've actually thought there was a big bear or something. I've never seen that before. Uh, we've got, oh, we've got an enchanted wooden sword. I'm not even going to bother grabbing that to be honest. I don't really need that. But I've got a whole load more arrows. So I've got so many arrows I can just fire them like uh, crazy and not uh, have to worry about Oh uh, yeah, worry about running out of them too much. That's the the chest I've already looked in. I could maybe go and have a look down here. Do you reckon there's going to be anything hidden behind the castle? Uh, no, there's just a few islands in that direction. Can I get on top of the castle anyway? I think if I go up here, uh, there's a there's a staircase that would lead me to the top round here. And oh look, there's some some burning boats there. That's what the fire is. And here we go. I managed to to get a helmet. I've got a pretty good weapon, and I got lots of potions and loads of food as well. Uh, but my only problem is I don't have too much armor. Uh, I do. I do want to get some some leggings and some uh, some boots if I can. I know I thought that was a doorway there, but it's just completely empty. So uh, let's have a wander around then. And let's go and see if I can I can get some better armor. And oh shit, I've not looked in here yet. Uh, but yeah, once I've got a bit better armor... Oh no, that is where I went. Uh, yeah, once I've got a, a bit better armor, then I think I'm going to be uh, ready to go and try and take out some of these these other players. And uh, it is quite a big map, but everyone does seem to be uh, constantly quite close together. Like, wherever I look, I can always kind of see someone wandering around. And I don't think this person knows that I'm here yet. Should I try, should I try and sneak up on them? Do you reckon I can get a nice quick early kill here and be able to take them out? I've got to be outside of the, uh, the grace period by now. And oh no, I thought I was getting to them, but I think they're, they're somewhere further away. Let's check this chest here. And oh, here we go. I'm glad I came in here, actually, because I managed to get some, some iron leggings there. I really didn't need that helmet, to be honest. I'm going to go uh, put that back, and I'll put that in there as well. And uh, way more food than I'm ever going to need, but I can't say no to it. i just got to go and take it all. And what I could do, actually, if I get some of this gold, uh, I know it's not great, but I could just make some, some gold boots, actually. There's a crafting table right here. And so if I make some, some gold boots, at least it's going to do for now. At least I've then got uh, a full set of armor. All right, I'm looking. I'm looking pretty good here. I'm looking. I'm looking pretty set. Can I see if I can go and try and take someone out then? I definitely saw someone uh, heading down here in this direction. Oh, there's nothing really over here. Oh, there we go. I can see them in the, the distance over here. This is like a like a hedge maze I'm going through here. <laughs> Let's go and see if I can try and take them out. I'm not sure who that is. I think that might be Finball over there. And I think he's seen me. And I don't think he fancies fighting me. And with the amount of armor I've got on as well, I probably wouldn't fancy fighting me either. He's there just running away. And look at that shot. Can I get him again? Can I hit him again? Oh, so close. And can I get him? There we go. I'm managed to hit him as well there. I got some some good health taken down on him there and I don't know I don't know if he's got anywhere else to run. Right, let's go try going around this side. This might surprise him a bit more. Going around the other way than than the way he went. And uh, yep, I did manage to surprise him. Oh, there's a creeper behind him! The creeper almost managed to blow him up there. Can I run in? Can I take him out? Right, if I go and use the bow and arrow, I can keep pushing him back. There we go! An arrow to the face! Able to take him out! <laughs> I think I kind of teamed up with the uh, the creeper there to be able to, to take him out. And uh, let's go grab all this stuff then. Let's see if he, uh, if he had any any good loot. That was quite good though. I got hardly hurt at all in that engagement and I got so many apples. I can go in here very quickly, go get all of my hunger back up. And there's all stuff scattered all the way down there as well. All right, let's crouch here for a little bit and uh, see what I got. I got a splash potion of healing. I'm going to get that ready. Uh, I didn't really get any any better armor. I got loads of bottles of enchanting actually. If I go and, while I'm safe down here, if I go and splash myself with all of these, then if I find a, an enchantment table, I can go and... Um, yeah, I can try and enchant my sword or like my bow or something and have an enchanted sword. And I think that's about it. I think that's all valuable that uh, that I got. So there we go. At least I managed to, to take one person out. And now let's go and have a see what was in here. Oh, look at this. An enchanted iron sword. That's not bad at all. And I, did I use my stone sword against him? I think I might have actually took him out with my stone sword rather than my iron one. Lucky I had uh, quite good armor as well. But look at this. I got knockback and sharpness on my iron sword. It was definitely worth coming down here. So I want to go and try and find a, an enchantment table and I see if I can enchant my bow. If I can maybe get fire aspect on it so I could set people on fire at range, that would be uh, rather handy. So let's go get my hunger up and uh, let's go and uh, head back into town. It looks nice with the uh, the sun setting in the distance as well. It looks like quite nicer over everything. Uh, but anyway, I can't I can't stand around admiring how nice this place looks because uh, there's a load of murderous pirates after my life. So <laughs> I need to, to probably be uh, watching out for them. Hmm, let's go and make my way through some of these ruins, shall we? I can't see anyone. At the beginning, there seemed to be people running everywhere. And here we go. I think over here on this boat, I think someone's trying to trying to set so oh they're in are they in the water? I think they're I think they're climbing up on top of the boat now. Who is that? 
I can't. That's super chat here. I wonder what he's got. I have no idea. He's got nothing. He has got nothing. He has not got any armor. He's not even holding a weapon. I think I feel mean taking him out. I don't think he's literally got anything. <laughs> Let's fire a few arrows, shall we? Right, this should be easy. Just as long as I don't let him escape, I should be able to pretty easily be able to go and uh, take him out. Oh, he left the game. He decided to leave. He couldn't handle it. He saw me running towards him and he just immediately left the game. Right, I could just sort of wait around there, uh, but I don't want that to be mean. I don't want him to just join back into the game and immediately get taken out. And uh, Jake on the Xbox was slain by Arbold. And I believe Arbold might actually be my biggest competition because, as, as I said earlier, he was one of the um was one of the the builders of the map. So he has got uh, a small advantage in sort of knowing his uh, way around the area. And oh, oh, hello. This isn't a bad chest, is it? Not bad at all. And another iron sword. Uh, once again, I'm just going to grab that so no one else can get it. And uh, another splash potion of healing. I probably didn't need another splash potion of healing, but that will do. And all oh, that fear of was slain, but Arbold just killed someone else as well. I told you. And Arbold, oh, then Arbold was taken out by Chloe. Somewhere around here, there is an epic battle going on, and I just missed everything. All I was doing was seeing the little text popping up on the screen. Like, almost half the players just got taken out in about 10 seconds there. <laughs> and oh, look, here we go. I can see someone over there. I don't know if that's just someone who died and then just respawned, though. I think that's what it what it might have been. Anyway, let's go around and try and find the enchantment table then, shall we? And oh, look, got some more bottles of enchanting and uh, a potion of swiftness. I'm going to go and grab that, and so I've got that at hand as well. And I probably don't need any more arrows. I think I've just got way too much stuff already and uh, did i see someone i thought i saw someone for a second oh behind me sneaking up behind me here who is this oh there's two people oh they're not teamed up are they is there someone right here here we go there's someone camping right around the corner here trying to get me <laughs> right tank matt you're trying to be clever were you? you're trying to be clever go try and get a few arrows oh no he managed to escape right swiftness let's use swiftness and chase after him i think a zombie had the the same idea to chase after him right let's go 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 i want to be careful i don't get run into to chloe as well i don't know if they were teamed up or they were just very close he really tried to ambush me there if i wasn't ready for that he could have uh, actually he managed to, to take me out then and all oh, oh no I, I did that very badly I've got swiftness though so if I I got swiftness so if I do just keep running I should be able to, to catch him up and there we go I went around the other way and I managed to catch him how is he not dead yet how is he still alive go on skeleton finish the job finish the job skeleton can I can I hit him one more arrow surely he's got to take him out no he's still running I still didn't manage to take him out. I gotta give him some credit. He's doing a good job at staying alive. He must have like two hearts or something. I oh, don't know, no, he just splashed himself with swiftness. Right, I'll do the same. I'll splash myself with more swiftness then, shall we? And we're in the water, shooting with a few arrows. Surely I can get him. There we go. That is Tank Matt taken out. Woo! Woo, that was a little bit intense, wasn't it? Any good loot down here? Uh, oh no, someone else is coming after me. No time to look at loot. No time to look at loot. Right, if I use the bow and arrow, I can just keep knocking her back here and, until I've managed to take her out. Let's splash myself with healing as well. Get my health volley back up. I think I can hear some zombies and all sorts behind me. And let's go and charge in. And there we go. I managed to take her out. I managed to take out Chloe. I hit it with an arrow. Is there anyone left? I think that was it. I think Chloe and Tank Matt were the final two people. I've won! I managed to win Hunger Games! <laughs> oh dear, you wouldn't have believed it if I hadn't have said, and what's this? Look, there's a spider jockey here as well. Right, do you want some? Do you want some as well? I'm going to take you out as well, seeing as I uh, seem to be on a somewhat of a, a killing spree. <laughs> ah, that was so much fun! What an epic, exciting round of Hunger Games. <laughs> anyway... As I said at the beginning of the video, there's going to be a link in the description to everyone else's channels. Uh, I think uh, quite a lot of people were recording, so if you did want to see their view, uh, yeah, definitely go and check that out. Uh, as well as a, a download to this uh, really awesome map if you wanted to uh, download it and play it for yourselves. Uh, sadly though, uh, we have just about run out of time on this episode here, so I want to thank you as always very much for watching, and I will see you all later. Bye!